Yo, what's going on, guys? CJ back with an episode of Los Angeles King Trend Mode of We had a, a fairly decent, all right, decent playoff run. Um, and then a, a solid offseason, I suppose. Excuse me, but in the last video, we left it off with where are we going to send Adrian Kempe? And don't worry, I already pre scouted who we're trading him for, or rather, where, where we're trading him, who we're getting in return, and also. Check. Oh, wait. Oops. What was it then? Ah, wait. No, no, no. Wait, was it him? Yes, it was his. Francis Duda. We're going to get him for the Buffalo Sabres now. This kid will be a project. There's no guarantee he'll be anything. However, he's got good enough trade value to where if we're in a good spot to make the off, which I'd imagine we're going to be, uh, come the trade deadline or some crap like that, we're going to go ahead and we'll flip the kid. Um, see what we can't get. And all that good stuff, but it's it doesn't hurt to have an extra prospect or two laying around. I'm also gonna I'm gonna put the uh, am I? No, I, I think I was gonna trade him, or I could just trade Kemp. I can just trade Hill, who's actually not terrible. You don't know he, Hill actually grew a little bit. Um, you'll see. I'm gonna move these two guys. Cause we gotta we gotta make some space. Plus, we're going to get assets back. You know, we're not just going to get this kid back. We're going to get a little bit more than that. Um, we could... We, actually, we could pick up... I was going to pick up draft picks, but I might just take the guarantees. Slash forwards. Like, we could use a two-way forward. There... Oh, fuck yeah. Okay, you know, let's, we're going to make a hell of a deal right here. This is not going to go through. I know it won't. Okay, good. Uh, well, not good, but, you know. You know, yeah, yeah. Um... Just trying to, I'm not trying to exploit them, but I'm trying to exploit them, if, if you catch my drift. Just trying to make moves, you know, see what we can't work out. Uh, you know, we're great friends with the Sabres, throw in these two pieces, yikers. Okay, what if we, what, do you guys want any of these guys? Uh, we could go ahead and trade Millman. Though I did want to use him. Yeah, I kind of want to use Millman. Millman's going to be the guy that replaces Adrian Kempe, I think. Yeah, his defensive touch is actually pretty beat. We know Millman's already in the lineup. Right. Wait, no, he's not. He's in the minor leagues. Yeah, I was going to call him up. Right. Right, 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 right. Okay, so we could actually... I don't have to do that. Uh, we don't really need these picks. I don't even know why I'm trying to go after them, to tell you the truth. I, I, I'm just trying to stack up. You know what? Yeah, we, we only need one first round pick. We, we, we only need two, rather. You, you can keep the second round pick. Uh, I'll just throw in those two rookie skaters that we ain't ever going to use. No matter what comes our way. And my brother's playing Fortnite. Um, hence the Anakin Skywalker. No. Uh, you know, I'll go ahead and throw in this low elite kid who's only 57 overall. Yeah, he's not really going to grow. I'll throw him in there. I'll throw him in there. Is that enough? Too far off. I bet you if we throw in a second, like a high second, they'll be like, you know what? Not a bad trade. Drive a hard bargain. Just a bit low. We'll check this out already. Let's see if I can cheat the system. Damn, Daniel. Well, actually, you know what we can do? Because this has a little bit more value. I bet you now we can get that 7th or 6th round pick or something. I'll check this out. Keep the 6th. Bro, get out of town right now. Um, I would rather not trade a 1st. Right? I would rather trade this guy. Yeah. Fuck. If we can find something they want that I'm actually willing to give up, this trade will go through. The, the, the problem is they have to want it. You have to want it. Uh, and right now they don't want it. I could trade Koozie. Nah, I like Koozie. Cause you're amazing. Just the way you are. Um, I don't know what Columbus is. They're going to get better in this trade. I'll take that Columbus first. You give me a second, a third, a fourth, a fifth. A s okay, you give me a... Stop making up enough value. This will have to work. Uh, I'm, I'm keeping that second. Mm, 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 mm. Check it. 
Uh, we'll throw in that kid now that we were just gonna trade before. I'm make I'm making this a long video, guys. So just, just hold on to your horse. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm in a good mood right now. All right. All right. Get your ass up here. Let's go. It's the chell, baby. It's the chell. Do da do da. Yank my toes off five miles long. Oh, the do da day. Everybody. Okay, we're we're off to fix those lines in a minute. Whatever. Best lines. I'll go through and fix them later. We just got to sign a quick free agent who's probably just going to sit and rot now that I've totally forgotten that I... Yeah, okay. He's, he's not going to do anything for us uh, because I have uh, Millman. I totally forgot about Millman when I signed him. My idea with Curtis Lazar was um, sign him to like a one-year $3 million deal for, for cap purposes, but also... Well, shit. I didn't even think with cap. I, I still don't think we'll be able to... Send down Duda, you dot man. Please send me a send this. Yes. We weren't able to send him down. We'd actually be in a lot of trouble. Uh, because I need that kid to grow in the worst way possible. So now you get to watch me edit lines, which is everyone's favorite thing to do. Uh, let's do uh, best lines. Yep, you know how that should go. Shaboom, shaboom. Yada, 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 yada. Christ almighty, you go there, you're going to come with me, Mr. Lad, you are going to get replaced by the millman. Green's going to go over there, uh, yeah, I'm going to have push your play center, boom, shaboom, shaboom, shaboom. Defense doesn't change, special, I didn't touch any of that crap. Uh, okay, yeah, Tenorti's got to get scratched for dude, I, you the man. That's uh, Sosanov, Sosunov, leaving Sosunov, I know, bad joke, bad taste. JS in there, Hoffman, Hassel Hoffman, good. Uh, go back to offense, uh, her, get out of her. Um, Ward, you can get lost. And Devane, consider yourself spared for the time being. Uh, our second line is actually pretty dope. I actually really happen to like our second line. Uh, we're just going to do... We actually know it was our third line. Yep. 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 Uh, yep. 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 And that is the wise man and Devane. So I like our minor league team a lot. Um, because I, I like that we have a bunch of veterans down here. I just find it pretty dope. Uh, and we got the young guys, and we got Volchenkov, we got an extra pack hard, we're going to pack hard with Ryan Miller, and that's how the show looks. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Let's go ahead and we'll do save file. Let's go, and he, there we go. And how much time did I waste with all those shenanigans? Only eight minutes. Let's go. Are you guys getting bored yet? Are you guys bored of my videos yet? Are you waiting for NHL 19 like I am? I feel like my contact sucks lately. I feel like I'm, I'm just like... I'm not shit posting. I just think my videos suck lately. I really do. I think they're very boring and and, and mild, mild mannered, which is really not the normal me, from as most of you know. Uh, but once you know, uh, who knows? Maybe we'll hit a groove because well, after this, I'll tell you what. After this, I'm gonna go ahead and record Mets franchise mode, and I'm probably just gonna. Actually, I don't know if I'm gonna do that directly after this. I I might dead ass just record like five or six LA videos now. That way, I don't have to go back and record them. At a later date. Well, because they're, they're getting less and less interactive. You know, we're kind of just... We're, we're in the dog days of summer. And, you know, hockey's not really a thing right now. There's no trade. It's been a very boring summer. I'm already back in school. It's just, you know... How much more could we do? To try to make this a not interesting game interesting. We just can't. I tried tearing it down with this team. I tore it down and we ended up making the playoffs. So we didn't even get a rebuild. We don't mind. We got a, a good young squad now. We're in like the best position we've been in in the entire franchise mode, and that's a lot considering we had three ninety-three overall centers. So that's pretty cool. You know, we're in a good spot. Um, yeah. So I'll just keep muttering on. I, you know what, you know what, I miss the most right now because I had a lot of fun doing it around this time last year with the Minnesota Wild franchise mode at its height. At its height. Do you guys remember the Minnesota Wild franchise mode? All 25 years simulated. That freaking series was hyped. Lilia Grin and Dolan as a top pair. 
Then we brought in that other kid who came out of nowhere later, grew to like 94, roll a defenseman. That was such a fun, like everything worked out perfectly in that in that franchise mode. Like everything that could have gone perfect. I might go back and watch it myself. That was a very, 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 very fun franchise mode to make. And I have not, I have, like I said such a high standard because I don't think we've topped it since. Like the Rangers franchise mode we did at the beginning of this year was pretty good, I think. Um, the Hurricanes franchise mode was pretty good. Uh, I don't think you guys like. I mean, I enjoyed. it. I don't think you guys did. Uh, the Kings franchise mode. This is a good franchise mode. It's, just, it's so late in the year. So much has happened. Everything's just kind of black, you know. And if we don't Carolina franchise mode, I mean, I went into it with the greatest of intentions, but the response to it wasn't phenomenal. So I kind of put it off to the side. Oh, maybe I'll go back and finish it at some point. But right now, I'm waiting for NHL 19. Um, and then once NHL 19 comes out, well, you know, we'll obviously we'll start it off with the Rangers franchise mode as we always do. Uh, but but next year I, I really want, I want to get back into it, y'all. I want to be recording daily again and pumping out videos and getting subscribers. Like I'm only at 352 subs. Like I feel like I've been stuck here for the past long while, and I deserve it to tell you the truth because I, I have not been good or consistent. So tis what it is. Uh, but I'm hoping NHL 19 is gonna be a big year for for my channel because I do want to get more into this. It's just been hard lately. You know, I'm starting a second job soon, so. A lot, a lot, a lot of stuff gets in the way. A lot of stuff does, but eh, who knows? Who knows? Fingers crossed that we, uh, yeah, we got it going again. Because I, I miss those daily recordings. It's just hard to do it because this game really sucked. Like, I don't know. NHL 18 was probably my least played NHL game in the past. Let's see when the, I really got into NHL around NHL 10. Oh, actually, no, NHL 9. NHL 2K9. So, yeah, almost like in the past nine years, it's probably my least played and least involved NHL game. And that's saying a lot, considering how much I played NHL 17. So I played 17 a lot, like, us, like as much as... Really, Coco? Really going to bark outside right now? I played a lot of NHL 17, and it showed. I was, I was uploading videos basically freaking daily. I was getting home from school, recording, and going to hockey, and just that was that. <sighs> Things have not been the same, though, in this game. They have not. Quite the opposite. This game was, it was more of the same, but it just, I don't know, I feel like, I feel like this game was just missing something that, I, I don't know. Tell me what, tell me what you guys think, if, you, if you've been watching at this point, or if you're just skipping past it. What, what do you think? Is it? What is it about NHL 17 that made this just the most boring NHL game of them all? What was it? Seriously, what what do you guys think it was? Because I have no idea. I honestly, I don't even watch like my favorite YouTubers. I I stopped watching them, and I, they've stopped uploading. Like two weeks. When was the last time Two BC Productions uploaded a video? Like three weeks ago. Like he's totally checked out. Uh, I mean, X-Tech uploads his franchise modes, but he's, like, the only guy that actually does the franchise mode right now that actually gets views. Like, I don't know. I feel like I feel like this year is just dead. I just don't think this was a good year for gaming. Well, maybe not gaming, because there, there are a lot of gamers that got popular, but they're doing different things, things that I can't do because I can't afford to do. NHL 17 was, like, a similar time. Hopefully we'll bring it back with 19. Uh, that's my intention, bring it back. And maybe make a new series. I don't know. I got to get back on the map. I was, you know, we were doing good. We were growing pretty good for a while there. And I've really, I've really just, just like fizzled. I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say fizzled out. I, I've i flatlined for the time being. Like I'm, I'm just seeing the same thing over and over again. And I'm not uploading. Like it, it's hard. It, it, it's not as easy as you think doing this when it's not like your full time thing. When you're just doing it for fun kind of thing. But you kind of need to be consistent as well. Ugh. I gotta get better at it, I know. I know. It's just hard sometimes, it really is. A lot a lot of stuff happens when you start college. I couldn't even imagine once you, you know, get like a full time job or whatever. I don't know how you adults do it. For I am just a nineteen year old who plays and well yeah, just records and Wait, one second. I think I recorded a video a couple days. No, that was like a week ago. 
Maybe I did. I don't know. I might, I might owe you guys an upload. I really don't know. No, 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 I uploaded that. That was, that was about a week ago, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm, you know, I've, I mean, I'm on four different hockey teams. I'm in college, about to start a second job. And you guys know the issues I have with the, the job I had last year. This job this year is, actually, no, it wasn't even last year. That was earlier this year. Job I have now screwed me out of my last job, which sucked. This one's just as screwed up. I've been when I when I applied for this job and went through the interview process, I was just totally lied to, and there's nothing I could do about it because North Carolina's an at-will state, so they could just fire me and not give a shit if I try to complain. Or, and I hope I'm hoping the second job, which pays a lot better and the hours are a lot better for me, maybe it'll be something for. Ooh, ooh, ooh. they want to give me back Henrik Borgstrom. Well, guess what? I don't freaking want him. Leave me alone. But um. Hoping this second job's good enough to where I could maybe just seriously diminish my hours on my job I'm working right now because the pay is terrible. The hours are just as bad. I love my coworkers and everything, but it just sucks, man. It sucks the life out of me. This current job. I, to, here, I, I work at. I have to. I wake up to go to work at four o'clock in the morning. All right, so I get home. I got a nap, catch up on my sleep or whatever, and then. It, and the day is already half lost. And then, like, I think, do I record? Oh, wait, I got to go to hockey. Or I got to go to school. Or I got to I gotta fill in for somebody else at work on a later shift. Like, I'm never really... It's, uh, it's, just, it's been hard, guys. It's been hard. Uh, okay, yeah, we're... Canucks are pretty good. All right, more importantly, how are our individual players doing? That's what I care about the most. Uh, ooh, hey, yo, I, yo. Well, the problem is the scoring has to be so spread out so, you know, guys can't just go off anymore. Gensel, I thought you were my setup man. Why the hell are you scoring goals? We've been over this. Uh, Robert Thomas is doing a good job of being the setup guy on that first line. Uh, yeah, we got a lot of power forward. We got a lot of guys that are chipping in goals. Uh, Bockvist, he'll never be a 90-point defenseman. Andre Kuhlman, Jesus, on that third pair. Uh, Tyler Wang. What a beast. 90 overall, 21 years old. I hope he grows to like a 94. That would be dope. Jack Chen. Jackie Chen. Not really that good. But uh, I guess he just... I guess he fills in. All right. London. Rensfeld. Not really the 50 goal scorer I envisioned when I drafted him. Yeah, I don't know how good this kid's going to really be. He might be trade bait eventually. Who knows? We got a good team right now. I don't want us grading up. Lance Gray finally started to grow. First overall pick from two years ago. Seems like a bust right about now, but who knows? Who knows? Jody Pusher actually grew a little bit. Hey, all right. I was getting a little worried about there. Worried about you there for a sec, bud. Quinn Hughes. Kid's not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, Marshall Millman. Man, am I glad I called him up. Seven Genos. The goon himself. Walter freaking Green, and the guy wants to be on the third line, but he's a fourth liner. And, of course, Travis Guerrero. How are we doing in net? UC Soros. He's certainly not uc -less. Rodney McLaren's killing it. Uh, Kuzi is having a year. All right, he's finally coming into his own a little bit there. Yeah, we got a beastly minor league team. It's just incredible. Uh, how's Jumbo Joe Thornton doing? Oh, the guy's attacked. Just get out of his way. Just get out of his way. Uh, let's take a look at the rest of the league in the NHL. Uh, yep, entire league. Uh, the Tarasang show is just going off. Uh, Jack Hughes apparently grew to a franchise player. Uh, sort by goals. Yikers. It's going to a bad year for goal scoring, I suppose. Well, I'm not going to do anything because we're doing so good. We're just going to go ahead and simulate the rest of the year. I'll call it a video. Might look... Ah. See, it's like I'm not like... Like, I should be like, oh, yeah, I can't wait to record the next video. I'm, I'm fucking exhausted. I worked this morning and I played hockey. Ugh, it was just... It's already been a long day and the day's almost over. It's just grr, you know? Just grr. I want to do something. You know, what the hell would happen... 
I should, I want to know what's going to happen when I get this second job because I would be at work right now. Damn, I don't know if I record. <laughs> yeah, I'd, have to, I'd have to really dig deep and figure out what the hell I'm going to do. Well, actually, well, that's, actually, that's not true at all. Because sun Sundays are going to be a little bit lighter for me because I'm getting off one team because I got kicked out of a league for scoring too much. I was in a lower division than I should have been because I never played ice before. And, um... And I, I did well enough now to where they, they gave... Well, I say kick me out. They just moved me up into a higher division. The higher division plays on different days uh, than my current day. So. You know. You know. <sighs> you know how that shit goes. All right. So we got Vancouver in the first... How the hell did that work out? Did we cool off? Did we cool off or did they cool off? What happened? It... Certainly wasn't us. Oh, Edmonton took. Oh, uh, Edmonton must have been closer than I thought. Okay, all right. Well, that makes things a little interesting. Damn, the top three teams in the league, all in the same division. We could not have picked a worse division to fall into. Uh, goals for were up there, but we're not number one, so I'm not happy. Goals against were up there, we're not number one, so I'm not happy. Power play percentage, we are up there, we're not number one, so I'm really not that happy. Penalty kill percentage, we're up there, but we're not number one, so I'm really not that happy. Uh, no, I'm not a broken record. Robert Thomas leads the team in points. Wowzer. Joshua Norris puts in 44 goals. A lot less than he had last year, but still a 40-plus goal year. Cannot be that upset about it. Jake Gensel is not a bad hockey player, as it turns out. Uh, probably going to sign and trade his ass because we got a lot of guys coming up. I want to keep them and all, but... We, we got too many, too much scoring coming up. We got to spread him out a little bit more. Tyson Jost, not a great year out of Tyson, but I want to hold on to him because we know how good he is in the playoffs. Jackie Chen, uh, Tyler Wang, yep. Bacchus McCarr, Blunden, 20 goal year for Gabe Blunden. Wow. He had 30 last year, though, so actually, yikes. Not a great year, Blunden. Not a great year at all. Bad, not a bad year, though. I can't get that upset at him. Look at that face. Uh, all right. Yeah, this kid's pretty much a boss. Well, unless he grows on, who knows? I'm not even looking at Soros' stats. We already know he's a beast. Take a look at the entire league. Uh, the Tara Sank show. Kid went off this year. But Gold Veining beats him out by one for the uh, Maurice Rocket Richard. I like it. Good for the kid, man. You got to feel good for him. Take a look at the playoff bush. Not the playoff tree. So you got Dallas, St. Louis, Vegas, Luzapeg. Vancouver versus your LA Kings, Edmonton versus Colorado, Rangers, Flyers, Penguins versus Devils, the Battle of Ontario, and the Tampa Bay Lightning versus the Washington Capitals. So, thank you everybody for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this. I'm making it end. If I said everything I just said, you're not in hearing it. I'll see you on the next one, which hopefully will come within the week. Peace.